On our last day in Baku, we headed to the nearby town of Sarhani. Sarhani is located about 20 kilometers outside Baku city. It is so different pa from Baku. We went to the market there and picked up some herbs and spices to bring home to cook with. It seems as soon as you step outside the city, you can see evidence of the oil and gas in the area. You can smell it. It was this oil and gas that drew people to the area for many years. This is Atashka. The name Atashka translates as Atash meaning fire and Ga meaning bed or throne. This name derives from the natural gas field that was beneath the temple for years. Due to the exploitation of gas in the area, this, this gas field supply has now been exhausted and the fire that you see is piped in. People debate whether it was founded by the Zoroastrians or the Hindus, but we know it has been used as a place of worship by both religions. Pilgrims would travel here from northwestern India to come and worship the fire. The pentagon-shaped courtyard was built in the 17th or 18th century, correct me if I'm wrong. Around it you can see little cells, a prayer room and canvasary rooms where travellers would stay and an altar with the flame burning in the centre. There are several inscriptions above the doors to the different rooms and this shows that it was used by different religions. Inside the rooms there is a small museum with artefacts that have been found on the site. They also have some mannequins showing us how they lived here many years ago. I'll be honest, I knew very little about ancient religions in this area. It's not something we learn in Ireland in school. Atashka has opened my eyes and I am ready to explore more of this region the next time I visit Azerbaijan. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed my time here. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos.